Fantastic Owl is really smart when it comes to video conferencing, and that starts with the way it displays the event. You can see I have this video conference with Michael in a few days, and it's got the video icon right in the calendar event. If I click on that, you can see there's all the details for the calendar event. And this is a Zoom call, but Fantastic Owl covers a lot more. It includes WebEx, Microsoft Teams, GoToMeeting, Ring Central, Google Meet, Blue Jeans, and Skype for Business. And that's really cool, but it goes even further than that. You can also create events right in Fantastic Owl. And I've got a separate video on that, but I'm going to show you one here anyway. Um, I'm going to create an event at 9 o'clock. And we'll just call this uh, Fantastical Video Call. And if I show more, there's the button to add a Zoom meeting. And like I said, there's a separate video on this, but I'm just going to click it and say I'm going to host this meeting. It's going to have a password. I'm all set. So I've just created an event and Fantastic Al has talked to Zoom and said, okay, create an event for David and it's done that. So I've got everything I need. And I, if I click on the event, you'll see all the details are there for that Zoom call. But you might notice some other things showed up. There's this cool join button and that is what they call one click join. So when it's time to go to the meeting or getting close to time for the meeting, as you can see, it's 8.51 now and the meeting's at nine, I can just click that and it automatically joins me into the meeting. Uh, there's also a button over here in the sidebar that does the same thing. But that's not all. If you go up to the menu bar, you can see Fantastic Cal also adds a little video conferencing icon to the menu bar next to the Fantastic Cal icon. That's one more way to one click join your call. Like I said, when it comes to video calls, Fantastic Cal is really smart.